हेलो एवरीवन नमस्कार फ्रेंड्स डायबिटीज इट्स अ कॉमन प्रॉब्लम इन आवर इंडिया 40% परसेंट ऑफ द पीपल आर फेसिंग दिस प्रॉब्लम दिस इज द रीसेंट स्ट्रैटी आई हर्ड इट इन न्यूज पेपर एनी वे वॉट एवर इट मे बी इट्स ईजी टू हैंडल फॉर युअर काइंड इन्फॉर्मेशन आई एम ऑल्सो फेसिंग दिस डायबिटीज प्रॉब्लम फॉर द पास्ट एट इयर्स डजेंट मैटर वी शुड नो हाउ टू हैंडल इट so today in this video i'm going to show you few yoga asanas and also breathing exercise and a few tips also this will be definitely useful for everyone all the diabetic patients if you are not diabetic please forward this video to those people who are facing this problem by the way my name is dr devika bhatnagar soft skills trainer and motivational speaker in our channel you are finding lots of motivational talks and motivational stories yoga and soft skills related okay now coming to today's uh, diabetes main three points remember food habits you should have a proper food habits and second thing is that exercises proper exercises yoga or any kind of exercises and asanas so this is must or walking jogging also and third thing is that handling the tensions handling the tensions depression worries all these things you, if you know these three you can live easily no problem at all diabetes cannot do anything to you you are born tough you will be very healthy now anyway so today i'll show you first three asanas then after that we'll go for one uh, pranayama also shall we go for asanas first for diabetic asanas we are just stretching our legs like this first then relax for some time now bend your left leg and with the right hand we are touching the left leg like this and back side you have to see hand will be on the back side so this is the position so at this position your pancreas is going to activate this is we call it as a vakrasan 30 seconds count your focus should be only on counting and breathing slowly count one two three like this then after that we'll change the leg now we are taking the we are just bending the right leg and with the left hand touching the right leg and totally as much as possible we are turning back so vakrasan in the same position once again 30 seconds slowly you have to count one two Three, four, like this. Thirty seconds. You count it. Thirty, thirty seconds. It means it's only one minute. Vakrasan. Then after that, take the normal position. Next, we are going to do another asan that is Mandukasan. For Mandukasan, we have to sit on Vajrasan. If you are unable to do, do please don't do it. Now fist your hands like this and press it with your stomach, and also keep on shaking your hands like this. Keep on shaking your fist so that pancreas is going to activate. So this is Mandukasan. Once again, slowly counting and count counting thirty seconds. Bend as much as possible. If you cannot do, please ignore it. 30 seconds mandukasan after that take it to the normal position and relax i have shown you one mandukasana in mandukasana what we have done fist we have taken to the navel part and we have pressed it and bending forward and after bending we are doing like this we are just moving a little bit of shaking our hands like this why what is the reason the main reason is that we have pancreas is here navel is this side no so just beside the navel two sides you will find pancreas is so this we are activating deactivation or not proper activation of pancreas is one of the main reason for diabetes for activating this we have gone for mandukasan and pressing like this now kapalbhati also we are going to focus on this pancreas 
we are going to exhale it forcefully when we exhale forcefully this pancreas is going to activate this is the main reason for going for this kapalabhati are you ready okay and then after that we'll go for the third asan for this we have to lay down like this now just raise your hands and legs like this touch it both the hands and legs has to touch each other so at this position we have to stay 30 seconds this is we call it as a dhanurasan dhanurasan is also very good asan especially for diabetic patients so 30 seconds we are doing dhanurasan slowly focus only on counting and focus on your breathing normal breathing you have to take So 30 seconds are over. Next, we'll go for tapping. Now, after this, we'll go for tapping of belly, stomach. Why? You know that just beside the navel, both the sides, there is a pancreas. Is that we have to activate? This is much useful for diabetic patients. Not only tapping in the morning, along with other tappings, even after lunch and dinner also, you can just tap by giving a gap of. 15 to 20 minutes you can just tap as i am going to show you so take the position you can start tapping with me okay so this is the position you take sit straight and start tapping slowly 50 times count it am i clear so you have seen three asanas now after that i wanted to show you one pranayama now this pranayama kapalabhati pranayama i am going to teach you kapalabhati pranayama also pancreas is we are going to activate with this pranayama entire body is going to shake with this pranayama best one for all diabetic patients i'll show you very clearly how to do this kapalabhati pranayama are you ready sit in any asana or sit on chair doesn't matter wherever possibility is there sukhasan vajrasan padmasan or on chair you can sit comfortably and take this position this is chin mudra so we are just attaching the index finger and thumb finger so chin mudra this is the position you take it and after that we are going to forcefully exhale inhaling is not a problem it can be done automatically you need not to focus on inhaling only you have to focus on forceful exhale like this you have to close your eyes and you have to do it but right now you open your eyes and observe slowly we'll do this kapalbhati forcefully i am ex exhaling when i am exhaling forcefully this portion is shaking a lot so that is activating the pancreas is at a stretch i'll do 30 counts 30 counts okay just observe Thirty counts are over. While exhaling, you have to focus only on your breathing, not on anything. Thirty counts are over, na? Thirty counts are over means this is first stage is over. Now thirty more counts, you do it. That is second stage. Thirty more times, three stages. Three stages. Every stage is thirty counts means total ninety counts you are doing. But at a stretch, thirty you are counting. 
and taking a little bit rest then after that once again 30 take rest and once again 30 like this you practice it around 10 to 15 days then after that 30 30 at a stretch keep on doing it look at the time 5 minutes continuously you do then after that you extend it to 10 minutes 10 minutes don't see how many uh, times you have done maybe 5 times 10 times whatever it may be doesn't matter but you have to see the time only 30 counts exhale rest 30 counts exhale rest like this 10 minutes you do this wonderful results you'll get I must share with you one more important thing what I do in the early morning you know so fenugreek seeds I made a powder in a mixi fenugreek seeds so that powder is kept it in a bottle every day one teaspoon of fenugreek seeds powder mixing in a half cup of water morning early morning when I wake up first I do this one only I just soak it in half cup of water after half an hour I just consume everything mix it with a spoon then consume it I do this please do follow this one also very useful and also very important thing you have to remember diabetes is not a problem at all how do you handle it how do you manage it this is most important so no worries don't keep anything regularly practice some physical activity physical activity food habits and handling the tension if this is there with you then you can handle anything please forward this video to all the people who are suffering with diabetes it will be helpful for them next time i'll come up with another interesting talk which will be useful for you all see you in the next talk so till that period what do you do keep smiling keep shining always stay healthy